Former President Jimmy Carter collapses during foreign trip. Here's what we know. Former President Jimmy Carter has been hospitalized during a foreign trip. He collapsed according to those on the scene. Here's what we know so far. Jimmy Carter and his wife, Rosalind, arrived in Canada this week to build and repair houses with Habitat for Humanity, but their trip was hit with unforeseen complications when the former president was hospitalized on Thursday for dehydration. Uh, we're live here in the newsroom today because President Carter collapsed while on a build up in Winnipeg, Canada. Habitat for Humanity is the organization he's dedicated so much time to and literally was building a home today. He's been up there for a few days. Uh, we've seen pictures of him uh, with his wife Rosalind was up there. It's 68 degrees up in Winnipeg today, so it wasn't hot like it is here in Georgia. But nonetheless, he still became dehydrated, felt a little bit weak. He was seen uh, collapsing. But after that happened, and he, there was some uh, you know, medical personnel that were there taking care of him, he was able to actually speak. So uh, President Carter seems at this moment to be fine. Uh, is going to be observed, obviously, when you collapse and something like that happens. You're going to need some medical attention. Someone will keep an eye on you just to make sure everything's okay. But again, this is a guy who, uh, you know, had a little bit of cancer and kind of went like this with the cancer and said, not today, I'm going to be okay. So we're hoping he's going to be okay. In the past, the Carter Center and his group has made sure that they um, are able to present a, a complete picture before they release information. So I would anticipate that um, President Carter will go through this process of evaluation and then at some point that they feel like they have a full picture that we should probably get more information. They've never been a group of people that jump to conclusions or release information before they're ready to do it. They do it on their timeline. And so um, I think it could be soon, but I think really that's going to depend on the Carters and how this observation process goes. A Habitat for Humanity volunteer told the media that she saw Carter collapse after he'd been working in the sun for about an hour using a handsaw to cut wood for a staircase. Carter's bodyguards rushed over and carried him to a nearby vehicle. Shortly afterwards, firefighters and paramedics were seen scrambling and an ambulance arrived. The 92-year-old was taken to St. Boniface Hospital as a precaution, where he is under observation but reportedly feeling fine. President Carter has been working hard all week. He was dehydrated, working in the hot sun, and has been taken off-site for observation. He encourages everyone to stay hydrated and keep building, said a statement uh, from the Carter Center. President Carter was dehydrated, working in the hot sun. President Carter told us he's okay and is being taken off-site for observation. He encourages everyone to stay hydrated and to keep building. Any further updates will come from the Carter Center. Well, let us know what you think in the comments below, and thank you so much for watching.